Hello my beauties and welcome to another week of new releases and sneak peeks. I'm super excited because there are some really beautiful releases here so I'm just going to oh, shift over here, nearly drop everything um, and I'm going to start with, a, with Spellbound Beauty. Now this is a brand that I have tried, I do have one palette from and it's an American indie brand and they have been sneak peeking their Coven palettes. Coven palettes? Well, here we go. Um, so, so far we have a few of the shades. It does say that there are duochromes within there. Um, this palette has nine duochromes. Okay. I like the sound of that. Um, it looks like it's going to be a really quirky, unique colour story. So I'm super excited to see what this looks like when it's finished. Um, do I have any more information? Hmm. Um, ah, tomorrow is the day or today is the day? I'm not sure. So by next week I should be able to show you what the finished palette looks like and give you more information. So yeah, super excited to see what that is. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, and then a new product to talk about from Makeup and Cocktails Cosmetics is a makeup cleansing balm. I wanted to give this a mention because cleansing balm is something I use to remove my makeup. Um, currently I'm using the Beauty Bay by Beauty Bay one, um, but I, I love how you just kind of rub the balm in and it melts the makeup away and it it just is so easy and for me that is a major plus. Um, it's in this really cute little tub with a pink lid. Um, yeah, what do we have here? So it says, introducing the new makeup cleansing balm. Um, melts in your hand, melt your makeup away easily, double cleanse with your favourite cleanser, it's got a grapefruit scent and it is suitable for all skin types and it retails for $15.99, that's US dollars I believe. Yeah, I really wanted to give this a mention, it's nice to see um, indie brands doing a bit more with the skincare as well, I like that, um, but let me know what you think. And I'm going to move on to, so I'm hoping I'm going to pronounce this name right. It's Zakiela Beauty and they have, have they launched this already? It says new, uh, three new shades. There's Lunaria, Ce Celebration and Hummingbird. Um, these look absolutely beautiful. Pink and green is my favourite colour combination and yeah, I love the look of these. Um, let me know what you guys think. I don't have any more information. Nope. So yeah, let me know what you think of these. I love these shades. And then we are moving on to the Doll's House Cosmetics. Um, this is a brand that I only discovered recently and they have this released already. I believe they have. Yes. Yes. They've launched these already. So there are three brand new juicy delicious shades of their lip oils um, enriched with, I don't know how you pronounce it, is it? Jojoba oil, jojoba oil, <laughs> um, with a thick butter-like texture. They're all you need this summer to keep your pout hydrated for longer. Um, so they've got these three, say shades. They've got like a slight tint in them. Yeah, I'm loving lip oils, lip balms, lip glosses, those kind of things, especially in the hot weather. So yeah. I love the look of these. I don't have a price here, but yeah, I like the look of these, especially at this time of year. Okay, so next I want to talk about Give Me Glow Cosmetics because they, have they released this already? Note this releases June 30th, 10 a.m. CST, and it's their Juicy Blueberry Palette. Um, they've put here, meet 
our new mini addition to the palette family and sister to the Juicy Olive palette. I love the look of these shades. The colour story is stunning. There's 10 pans. This 10 pan palette comes with a multi-chrome foil bake sale queen, which is a rich blueberry base that shifts deep blue, purple and magenta. Then we have my favourite sugared blueberry drizzle, a mix of four pastel multi-chrome pigments, which makes this beautiful multi-dimensional I can't speak. Multi-dimensional periwinkle shimmer. And then there are eight creamy mattes that we legit copied from an actual muffin while creating this. I like that. Um, yeah, I love the look of this. I think it is a really unique, beautiful colour story. Yeah, let me know what you guys think and are you going to be picking this up? And then moving on to, so Tracy's Powder Room. Oh my God. They have, hang on, what day is it today? They've already released it. So they've released um, a new collection this shade is called Tropic Like It's Hot. Absolutely stunning. I have not tried anything from Tracy's Powder Room yet, but I say yet because they are on my list. This shade looks absolutely stunning. I love the imprint of the palm trees in it. It's beautiful. If any of you guys have tried anything from Tracy's Powder Room, let me know what you think of it. What's the formula like? I would really like to know. Um, but yes, this has been released already. Let me know what you think. So next up, it's really bizarre because I was only saying in my Collection and Declutter video that I hadn't heard anything from Unique Beauty in a while. Well, my friends, they popped up. So they have available now these four, five, five, new palettes and they are eight pan palettes and there are three that have caught my eye big time so I'll put the picture up obviously I've been doing that all along um so there is girl boss which is the green one we know that one has caught my eye then we have drama queen which looks absolutely stunning I'm assuming that is the top left one uh glow up it's giving main character that is the one on the right there the in the middle on the right um because that one is all duochromes and then there is everyday diva so i think glow up is the top one but yeah the two on the left and the one on the right are the three that have super caught my eye i love the look of these um i don't have a price here but they're available now yeah i i may just have to pick one of these up we shall see but yeah let me know what you guys think okay so next up is creature cosmetics and i wanted to show this this is so cool and it's got like the brain image in it so what does it say here it says party with tarman and his all new Tarman Toners. This four pan face palette comes with two contour shades, two blushes and a whole lot of brains. <laughs> Features two of the pinkest pinks we've done yet. This is the face palette you've been dying for. It's coming soon, I believe. I absolutely love this packaging. It's so cool. His face is both creepy and hilarious all at the same time. I absolutely love love the look of this and I'm I'm not averse to face palettes I love a face a good face palette um yeah I think this looks super cool let me know what your thoughts are and if you're going to be picking this up then next up is a new indie brand and this is Otica Otica Cosmetics I don't know how to pronounce that apologies and they have their new palette it is a 14 pan palette called black baccara black baccara again not 100 percent sure on how to pronounce that um but this is more on the neutral side for me but 
one that I can get on board with. Um, looking at the some of the shades, it's very similar to some of the shades I have on my eyes today, actually. Um, I don't have a price or anything here, but I am super excited to see where this brand goes, what else they're going to come out with. Yeah. I think they've done a great job with this palette. It is beautiful and it's going to cater to a lot of different tastes. You've got your more neutral tones, but it definitely has some depth for some drama. Let me know what you think. Okay, so next we have Mez Beauty and they have released or revealed. Um, it's coming on June the 30th. The new palette it is called Swarthy. It is a beautiful, neutral more warm like really warm toned palette it makes me think of the desert i think it is beautiful and um, this is definitely going to cater to a lot of tastes um it will retail for 26 us dollars and there are six buttery mattes six shimmery shimmers perfect for all seasons so yeah the top row is all mattes and then the bottom row is shimmers i think this is a very beautiful looking palette let me know what you guys think and if this is something you're going to be picking up and then we move on to a sneak peek so mica beauty shop um which is a brand that i have two palettes from now and i am in love with them um so they are sneak peeking three shades from their new butterfly kaleidoscope palette pink and green guys oh, seriously pink and green why do they do this to me um, I'm super excited to see what the whole palette is going to look like based on these three shades. I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to want it. But yeah, I don't have any more information on that just yet. But fingers crossed by next Saturday, I will have more information to share with you on this. But I am super excited to see what this, what the full palette looks like. And then next up is a new to me brand or i think they're a new brand in general so this is russia b cosmetics and it says coming this summer their nile palette it's greens you know i love it i think this looks beautiful i don't have any more information whatsoever whatsoever and this is the first time obviously I'm talking about Russia B Cosmetics. If this is a brand you know anything more about, please do feel free to let me know in the comments section below. Yeah, I do. I love seeing new indie brands coming out. Okay, so next. So I was super excited for the um, Little Shop of Horrors inspired palette from Indie B Cosmetics. Now they are sneak peeking the Labyrinth. Another one of my favorite films so i think guys i'm gonna have to hold out and i'm gonna want this too so i think i i'm definitely gonna want this it's the labyrinth so yeah i think i keep saying i think i know i'm gonna want it it's the labyrinth okay so this is all i have so far this picture i am keeping my eyes peeled because it's the labyrinth and if you know you know it's it's a classic i love the film and yeah they're just picking all my favorites at the moment so yes i have a feeling that you'll be seeing indie beat cosmetics coming up on my channel soon so yes as soon as i have any more information i will let you guys know and then moving on so i have swatches here of beauty moon cosmetics new lip icons um so there's 14 brand new lip stain matte and gloss shades um they are nine pounds each available now um which is around 11 us dollars i love the look of these shades they look beautiful um they're definitely on my list right now um i i'm loving beauty moon cosmetics the uk indie brand that i discovered recently um and yes in love with these look beautiful i think there's a really nice range of shades let me know what you guys think so next up 
we have Glam Light and they have collabed with Rick and Morty. I love the look of this. The palette, the greens with pinks and purples. Okay, I'm I'm a sucker. Um, the highlighter palette looks beautiful. I absolutely love the look of this. And I believe this launches today. Yes. So there is a Rick and Morty setting spray for 15 US dollars and it's Glamlight's first ever setting spray. So super exciting that they are adding something else to their lines. Um, the duochrome highlighter trio, love the look of that. Um, accelerated time lip kits for 14 US dollars. I didn't say how much the other things were. So the highlighter palette, that's 18 US dollars. And then the lip kit is 14 US dollars. There's a hologram lip kit for 14 US dollars and the 30 shade palette will retail for 36 US dollars. I can't speak. 36 US dollars. Um, the whole bundle is 90 US dollars and it has a 97 dollar value. Okay, it launches today. I'm not sure on the time. It, what time? Oh, there is a time here. It's Saturday, 8 a.m. PST. So I would imagine by the time the video goes, this video goes up, it will be available. I do also know that this collection will be coming to Monolith, um, which is uh, European stockist. So yeah, I have my eyes on this collection. And then next. So next up, I am super, super, super excited to announce that as of next Saturday, the 1st of July, my collab palette with Saints Angel Sinners um, and Avida is going to be available to pre order at 11, 11 a.m. EST, which will be 4 11 p.m. British summertime. I got that right, I'm sure I did. Um, so yes, this is my collab palette, so excited. The first 70 orders will receive the makeup bag, which is, I know I'm biased, but I think it's super, super cute. Um, oh, guys, literally, I am buzzing, absolutely buzzing. And hopefully by next weekend, I'll have my actual physical palette to be able to do swatches etc with um lots of makeup looks i'm probably going to drive you guys nuts for a bit but this is so exciting i still can't believe that i have my own palette <laughs> seriously is like a dream come true um so in my palette steph's here um there are six mattes and then you've got um 12 duochromes and they're absolutely gorgeous trust me and then there are six multi-chromes the multi-chromes on the bottom row are just absolutely stunning absolutely stunning i'm so excited to be able to share this with you guys now that we have a pre-order launch date and yes that is the 1st of July 11 11 a.m. EST 4 11 p.m. BST um so yes the palette will retail for 92 US dollars um you can use my code which is Steph 20 which will make it 74 dollars 60 um the whole bundle or the bundle which includes the palette and the large case that will retail for 133 US dollars, but with my discount code, um, that will make it $106.40. I'm so excited, super, super excited. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'm so proud of this, so, so proud. And yeah, working with Darcy has been a dream. This has been so much fun. And Avida, Vivi, you're pretty she just really helped pull it all together it's just so so proud so so proud and i'm so excited to see other people's looks with the palette also oh. okay 
I can't take up all of new releases and sneak peeks talking about my palette. I wish I could because I'm so excited. Um, but yes, so I'm going to move on. Uh, two, Cosmic Brushes. So their Delicious Delights palette is now available along with the Frosting Highlighter Trio. These look absolutely stunning. The palette retails for £25, that's British pounds, and the highlighter is £16, again British pounds. Um, the palette looks absolutely stunning. These swatches sold it to me straight away. Um, I have actually ordered this and the highlighter palette, so they will definitely be coming up on my channel very soon, as soon as I have them. Um, but yes, they said this is the final sibling to the other palettes. Um, I do have the Royal Rose and the Serenity. I don't as yet have the Muse. So I'll have, when this arrives, I'll have three of the four. Um, but yeah, this is such a beautiful, bright, colourful, amazing colour story. I'm so excited for this. And these highlighters, you've got... Gold Apple, which is a vibrant green to gold shift. Cinnamon Swirl, which is a reddish purple with a soft gold shift. And Blueberry Muffin is an ultraviolet purple to blue shift. I cannot wait to have these in my hands. I cannot wait. Seriously, this is such a beautiful collection. I think they've done an absolutely fantastic job with this. I am so excited. So yeah. You will definitely be seeing that coming up on my channel soon. Okay, guys, so Lethal Cosmetics has a new collection which is going to be launching June the 30th. And they have six pure metals and six multi-chromes. And there's also an empty constellation 12 pan palette. Or 12. If it's 12. Okay. So the pure metals you've got... Um, so absolutely beautiful colours. So I'll pop the picture of the metals up first. These look absolutely stunning. I love the look of these. Absolutely beautiful. Especially kind of the the top one, third one down, and the bottom one. They're stunning. I love the look of these. And then we have the multi-chromes. These just look phenomenal. I love the look of these. I do have a lot of shadows from Lethal Cosmetics. A lot. Um, mm, I can definitely see me picking up maybe a couple of these at some point. Yeah. I love that they've done the metals and the multi-chromes. I think it's a decent sized collection. I love the look of this collection. Let me know what you think if you're going to be picking any of these up. Um, I am a fan, huge fan of Lethal Cosmetics. So yeah, I'm excited. And then, oh my word, Blend Bunny have done it again. Another absolutely stunning palette. I love the look of this. So this is Sugar and Grunge and it is launching June the 30th. It is so beautiful. I have a few palettes from Blend Bunny. I absolutely adore the formula. Yeah. Yeah, I love this. And yeah, kind of 90s grunge. It definitely takes me back to the 90s, this colour story. I absolutely love it. I think she's done an absolutely amazing job. Um, it's going to retail for 41 US dollars. Yeah, I love the look of it. Let me know if any of you guys are going to be picking this up. I love the look of it. I love Blend Bunny Cosmetics. So yeah, super excited for this new launch. And then we will move on to Kristen Lee Cosmetics. So here I have a picture of the swatches um, of the Spring Fever 2.0 collection. I particularly the top, the top shades, the two pictures on the top um, with the blues and the purples and the greens. I love the look of those shades. These look abs absolutely stunning. Again, Kristen Lee Cosmetics is another brand that I haven't tried yet. Yet. Again, um, because they are on my list. Yeah, I love the look of these. 
they look beautiful let me know what you guys think okay then we are moving on to creature cosmetics again and this is a new glitter palette so this is this is a way of life return of the living dead and creature cosmetics in collaboration with um so this is the all new officially licensed gutter punk glitter palette um it's got seven pressed glitters i love the look of this i love pressed glitters if you know me you know i love the, i love the glitters i love that it's a really quirky shaped palettes car and then in there the shades are in the shape of coffins i love the look of this i think this is gorgeous um again creature cosmetics is a brand i do have one palette from so yeah i love the look of this let me know what you think and then we have a sneak peek from the pastel roses uk which is a brand that has my heart I absolutely adore the single shadows from the pastel roses so they are sneak peeking two palettes and they look to be are they loose pigments or flakes hmm, I haven't got my glasses on um, but yes they've got a more neutral palette and a really colorful palette these look absolutely gorgeous it says stay tuned saturday 24th june is it the 24th today yes i'm not sure if today is reveal day like full reveal or launch day hmm. i'm not sure but yeah i love the look of this collection i think they've been very clever to do the two palettes one more neutral one more colorful definitely gonna appeal to a lot more people a more wider variety of people um but yes i absolutely adore their formula it is amazing and then smb beauty they have a new product this is available very soon so this is a new candle scully candles and i think they are super cool I, I love candles. I really wanted to give these a mention because I think they're super cool. Let me know what you guys think. Then Gloss Gods are sneak peeking and I'm so here for, if all of the colors in this picture are in this palette, I am so here for this. So here for this. This looks absolutely right up my alley. Um, it just says, keep your eyes on the sky so as soon as i have any more information guys i will share that with you um but yeah i'm super super excited i love their formula let me know what you think and then finally the last thing i have to talk about today is from meggy lashes which is a uk indie brand and they've just released their lash serum um it's a double-ended lash serum um, it's the same on both sides, but each side has a different brush, so you can get to every lash without a struggle. Um, it can also be used on brows. Do I have a price? I don't have a price here, but this is new. I believe available now. I'm in, intrigued. I'm definitely interested. So, yeah, I wanted to give that a mention. I'm just going to move back to the middle so guys let's have a chat in the comment section below if there's anything i've mentioned today that you're going to be picking up if you have picked it up if it's on your wish list let's have a chat in the comment section below i do love chatting with you guys um if you're new around here and you love to support indie brands and you love colorful makeup please do hit the subscribe button um please like this video hit the like button if you've enjoyed it because that really helps me out um so yeah thank you so much for watching today i hope you're all having a great day great evening wherever you are and whatever you're doing i hope you're taking care of yourselves i will see you again very very soon goodbye yeah. stepping in the spot like she own it looking like the world is your runway she can set it off like a gunplay oh my yeah talk of the city with the body Praise like it's Sunday. She said, Baby, what you gonna do by?